to do at home during quarantine. Because of the coronavirus, events of all kinds were banned in the world. Employers were asked to provide the possibility of remote work. Schools and universities are moving to distance learning. World Health Organization recommends that you refuse to visit shopping centers and restaurants, avoid crowding, and generally less often than you leave your home. We have compiled a selection that will help you pass the compelled self-isolation. Many services have open free access for the time during quarantine. What can you do in order to not go crazy from the endless sitting at home? Watch TV shows and movies. The most obvious option is to finally review your favorite series. Or watch those films that you have long wanted but did not have enough time. At the same time, a couple of episodes of some dubious premiere, which are discussed on Twitter, is the best time because many online movie theaters have introduced a free subscription for the time of the virus. HBO will remove its paywall for 500 hours of free streaming content during the coronavirus pandemic. The selection includes acclaimed series such as The Sopranos and The Wire, as well as some movies and documentaries. Amazon Prime Video, which is available on more than 200 countries, the platform will be streaming movies that were supposed to be showcased at SXSW event, which got canceled over COVID-19 fears. The flicks will be free to watch. Apple made Oprah Talks COVID-19 free for streaming on Apple TV+, Plus, where she interviews guests such as Reverend Wintley Phipps and Idris Elba over FaceTime video calls to offer hope and thought during the pandemic. Self-education In response to the number of states, districts, and schools that are shuttering schools to students over the next several weeks in response to fears about the novel coronavirus COVID-19, education technology companies have stepped forward to help educators reach students in virtual ways. In many cases, the companies are making their paid services free through the rest of the school year. In other cases, they're lifting limits to services and or adding premium features to what's free. With an increasing number of universities shutting down campuses and shifting their learning online to try and contain the spread of the coronavirus, Coursera, a U.S. online education company, announced today that it will provide any impacted university in the world with free access to its 3,800 courses. The Academy of Active Learning Arts and Scientists and the Flipped Learning Global Initiative have published the rapid transition to online learning. The resources include a checklist of administrators, another for IT managers, a transition plan, and a video tutorial for teachers. Achieve 3000 is offering free access to resources for differentiated literacy instruction. Educators can access three different programs. Achieve 3000 Literacy at Home offers access to nonfiction articles at three reading levels with topics covering science, social studies, and current events. Adigy, a cloud-based Apple device management platform, has announced free 60-day access for schools. The program helps organizations deploy, manage, track, and troubleshoot problems for users remotely and in real time. If you know of a company that would be included on the list, please share it with us. Play board games. Board games are becoming one of your favorite pastimes. A good game can replace a TV, computer, or even a phone for a long time. Our sponsors, smartsales.co.uk, offer such a game, for which many thanks to them, a link to the site in the description. Virtual Walk in Museums Fortunately, in the era of the internet, you can visit the greatest museums in the world without leaving your own home and not paying attention to their closure in connection with quarantine. Here are just a few options. The Louvre Museum, one of the greatest museums, offers a 360-degree panorama of the museum and even a close look at the rare artifacts around. If you click on the exhibits, you can get additional information about their history. The National Gallery of Art in the United States has about 1,200 paintings. This is one of the best collections of Italian Renaissance paintings in the world, works of Dutch and Spanish Baroque. The Google Art Project works with more than 60 museums and galleries from around the world. Using Google Street View technology, a visitor can explore the collections of, for example, the White House in the USA, the Museum of Islamic Art in Qatar, and even the Sao Paulo Museum from Brazil. Watch opera or ballet. 
The Vienna Opera noted that daily it will be free to broadcast recordings of its opera and ballet performances through the stream platform on stratospurlive.com. Streams will begin at 1700 Central European time and remain available for 24 hours. Have a Skype party with friends. The format that came to us from China, we call up on Skype, select a DJ, and dance in front of the cameras of smartphones or computers. Of the bonuses, when you get tired of dancing, you don't have to spend money on a taxi. And yes, you can come to the party, even in pajamas. Work out. It's not necessary to buy a treadmill. There are tons of free homework tutorials on YouTube, from relaxing yoga to exhausting Tabata. If you are not lazy, then after self-isolation, you can show off your fitness results, and not just online. Complete all video games. The iconic Pokemon Go has announced that you can now catch Pokemon without leaving your home. However, they are not only Pokemon. For owners of computers and consoles, the choice is almost unlimited. Finally, you can go through Death Stranding, admire the extremely detailed GTA V, or appreciate the depth and drama in Red Dead Redemption 2. Start learning foreign languages. Self-isolation of language learning is not a hindrance. It is enough to register for free Duolingo, subscribe to native speakers on YouTube, and watch the series in the original with subtitles. Create a personal blog. Remember, in childhood, we read adventure books, fans of cartoons about superheroes, and dream that someday we would be real heroes ourselves? It is difficult to find a more suitable time. It remains to document your superhero, so that there is something to remember. The real superheroes in 2020 are those who reduce their social contacts to slow down the coronavirus pandemic. For today, that's all, friends. If you like the content, support us with an invaluable like share the video and write comments and for those who watch the video a gift a discount on all smartsales.co.uk goods with the worth now promo code and for orders from 30 pounds free delivery to anywhere in europe with the hashtag stay home promo code thanks <laughs>